okay? They have different names for it. doesn't matter what it is. If it's bacteria in the stomach, you have to remember why bacteria comes there. Bacteria is uh, our friends, per se. They're there to do a job. They're there to um, eat and, and break down acidic uh, remnants, any kind of waste, any kind of toxins. Bacteria are there to dissolve it, okay? So they're not actually um, bad. It becomes bad when they become um, out of control. And this happens when you eat the wrong foods, the animal products, cook starches. It leaves um, in, your, in your system dead, putrefied food. And these um, bacteria come there to, to eat it and dissolve it. That's what they're there for. So if you don't want the bacteria in there, the real way to fix it is to stop eating the foods causing this issue and go on 100% food diet. The reason why I use 100% fruits because it's easy to digest. It doesn't stick around. It doesn't stick onto the bowel walls. It, it, it moves out of your system quickly. Okay, It feeds and generates the tissue and cells and you get all the benefits. You want to use something called Parasite M and lots of it. Okay? It's a, t a herbal tincture that has um, herbs for um, par parasites and you want to use cat's claw as well. So cat's claw and Parasite M as well as Fab 5 is what I would use personally if I was dealing with this issue with bacterial overgrowth in your, in your stomach or wherever it is. Address the real cause. It's a kidney issue, it's a lymph issue, it's, it's an adrenal issue. So this is how you get rid of the actual cause, not treated but the actual cause.